What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you my favorite fall lipsticks. I have 12 of them lined up right here. A lot of them are from the same brand. We have lipstick versions, we have glosses. I don't know what else to say except for get ready for a bunch of dark lips because fall is dark lipstick season. So here we go. We're going to start with the blackest of the black. So this is NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Alien. So this is just their black lipstick. And I love this formula. As I have mentioned before on my channel, this is my favorite lipstick formula of all time. And I don't know, it's just like really pigmented and it's a black. So I mean, you can't go wrong. Okay, so here is NYX Liquid Suede in Alien. I love this color. I wear it quite often actually, which, you know, I'm just really weird with the dark lipsticks. Dark lipsticks are my favorite thing ever and I just love it so much. It's only the first one and I have a feeling that by the end of this my lips are gonna hurt like a mofo. The next one we have is another NYX Liquid Suede, and this one is in the shade Stone Fox. This is my absolute favorite lipstick of all time. It doesn't matter what season it is, this will always be like my number one. I don't know what it is, the color just like on point, and I think like it's just like a really unique color. A lot of people don't wear this, so. So pretty. Horrible application, but this is NYX Stone Fox. It's like, I would say it's a dark grayish teal color. Like it's a gray with a teal undertone for sure. I love this. Just wearing it with a gray sweater, gray t-shirt, basic eyes. It's so, so pretty. And I love it so, 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 so much. So highly, highly recommend if you're looking for a unique bold liquid lip. The third one I have for you, you can honestly wear any time of the year. This is another Lix NYX liquid suede in the shade Jet Set. I use this for like a hot sec in my Seahawks tutorial, but this one is just a really pretty blue. You could honestly wear this in the summer as well, but I'm just gonna put it in the fall just because it's darker, bolder, and I don't know, seems more fall appropriate, I guess. Okay, here is Jet Set by NYX. Again, just a super pretty royal blue. You can honestly wear this with just whatever blues you have. It's just a very pretty one. I wore this for 4th of July. I have a beanie that has this kind of blue on it, so I, you know, wear it when I have the beanie on. I love, love, love this blue. Okay, we're gonna jump into purples. This is Anastasia Liquid Lipstick in Potion. This looks super dark. Like, it's almost, almost black, but you can tell that it's, like, slightly purple. But this one is really pretty, really dark. I wear it a lot. I wear a lot of dark lipstick in the fall, and this is one of my favorites along with the Stone Fox. So here's this one. Okay, so here is Potion by Anastasia. I do actually enjoy the way that this applies better than the NYX Liquid Suede, but I like the way that the NYX Liquid Suede last. You know, they last better. Oh no. Oh no. The NYX ones don't dry down as, as dry. Like, they're not as drying, so I would say that that's the reason why I like those more, but I like the way that this one applies a lot better than the NYX Liquid Suede ones. Okay, so for the next two, I'm only gonna swatch one, which is gonna be the NYX Liquid Suede, of course, but these are both very, very similar in color. I'm gonna swatch both of them on the back of my hand so you can see the comparison. This one is the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Vintage, and it's more, I would say, on the plummier side than uh, Persistent Plum from L'Oreal. This is more of like a, just a dark red, and obviously one is in like uh, liquid lipstick form and the other is an actual lipstick but they're pretty similar this is vintage this is persistent plum I love both of them I 
wore this one a lot in high school with like a red flannel and the dark bold lip but i have recently just been loving the kind of plumish undertone that this one has so here is what nyx liquid suede in vintage looks like Again, horrible application, but this is what vintage looks like. Just a classic deep red. So, so perfect for fall. If you want to throw on like a red flannel, throw on the dark lipstick. Yes. Yes, girl. Work. Okay, another dupe comparison. <laughs> I have the Charlotte Tilbury lipstick in Glastonbury, and I also have the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Transylvania. Let me do a quick swatching so you can see the difference or similarity I should say. They are legit the same color. This one just has like another layer on top of it. This is the Charlotte Tilbury. This is the NYX Liquid Suede in Transylvania. The one I'm going to swatch for you is the Glass and Berry one from Charlotte Tilbury. I love the packaging. Rose gold. Yes, yes, yes. Rose gold is everything right now. Um, but this color is just the perfect like berry and You can like keep darkening it up. Sometimes I layer the two I'll put the glass and berry on the bottom and then as like a base for the NYX soft matte lip cream and then Make this one a little bit more matte by using the Transylvania right on top so here is Glastonbury, so it's this one. So, so perfect for fall. I cannot get enough of this. It's such a good berry color. And same with Transylvania. They're just so, so perfect. And I love, love, love this color so much. <laughs> okay, moving on, we are going to start with some browns. The first brown I have is the ColourPop Ultra Satin Lip in point zero. This is a collaboration with, guess who? Kathleen Lights. Wow. What are, why are we surprised by that? I don't know. But this is such a pretty grayish brown color. It's a cool tone brown, making it kind of grayish-y. So here's what point zero looks like. So this is what point zero looks like. Like I said, it's a very cool toned brown. So it's so pretty. Good job, Kathleen. I love this color so much. <laughs> and it's in one of my favorite formulas, so yes. Okay, this next one is also from ColourPop. This is the ColourPop Lippy Stick in the shade Pitch. It is a matte formula and it's just like a super dark brown. I would say this is uh more of a warm brown than a cool tone brown but here's what pitch looks like okay so that is what pitch looks like like i said more of a warm dark brown and it's just so chocolatey and yummy looking i'm just like mm, yes two more liquid lipsticks and then we have one gloss and we're gonna start with the liquid lipsticks because we have another dupe alert one is of course another nyx liquid suede and the other is by the balm this is the meet matt hughes in committed and this one is in soft spoken soft spoken is a very popular nyx liquid suede so you know i'm sure you've seen this all around youtube or on the internet but these are literally like almost the exact same color my friend wore the balm one one day and i wore the other one that on the same day and people were asking us if we wore the same lipstick and it's like insane one is slightly darker than the other but the undertone is the same so this one is soft spoken and this one is committed committed smells like like all the meat matt hues by the balm they smell like thin mints i'm gonna swatch the nyx wick with suede one because that's the one that I've been doing. So here is what Soft Spoken looks like. To me, this is what the perfect fall nude looks like because it's darker than usual and it's just so, so cute. And if you need a nude lipstick, these are like $7, I'm pretty sure. There you go. Also, 
I'm so sorry if you hear doors slamming or like talking. It just happens to be the way it is in a sorority. And finally, we have the gloss. I'm actually gonna put some foundation right over my lips just so we can see the uh, gloss just a little bit better. So this is the shade My Jam in the metallic version of this ultra glossy lip from ColourPop. And it's just like so, so pretty. It's like a bronzy rose gold. I don't know, but it's so, so perfect. Throw this on top of point zero. Throw this on top of just like anything. Make it a little bit more uh, pow-ish, you know? So, so, so pretty and so cute. Perfect for fall. Bronzy rose gold. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so now that my lips are officially dying, I just put on the lipstick I was wearing earlier today. These are my favorite fall lipsticks. I'm so, so, so excited for you guys to see what I love to wear in the fall. If I'm gonna recommend anything to you, it is gonna be the NYX Stone Fox. It's just like the coolest color ever and you can honestly wear it with just a plain black t-shirt and a jacket and you'll be fine. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to click the subscribe and like buttons and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.